Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to make a very quick video um, on something that really bothers me and I thought maybe I would just educate some people on this. Um, so I'm just going to reach across right here. Um, this right here, these brushes are Blink by Blink Beauty. This is a um, fluffy eyeshadow brush. And I've seen unique presenters and makeup artists use this on their eyebrows. Um, this is not an eye eyebrow brush and it kind of just irks me because unique presenters are not makeup artists as much as they would like to think they are and I'm not knocking on them I'm just saying this right here is an eyeshadow brush um it's quick also this right here is a concealer brush it's a rounded one but I use it for my eye concealer blending out the eyelids um just in case cleaning up and highlighting the brow bone now this right here it even specifically says eyebrow on it there we go you can see that it's a slanted eyebrow brush with a thicker bristle um it's a little bit more yeah, it's a little harder than the other ones because it's meant to get up in the eyebrows and like groove in the notches, you know, getting right in there. Um, and the reason I'm saying this is because I've learned and I'm educating myself a little bit more on videos and um, brushes. Sorry, that's most of my brushes. I got a lot of them. They're just dirty and you just can't see them because I have a lot of little ones too. Um, uh, it, just, it just drives me insane when I see videos and they're using the wrong brushes. Like they'll use these ones. This one's dirty, but it's brand new. It's the Wet n' Wild ones, which are amazing. They're gluten-free vegan and they're the soft ones, the pink. Same with this one right here. It's just dirty. It's the flat top. I use it for foundation because it's flat and it's amazing. Um, you know, my eco tools, all my poor little eco tools, he's falling apart. Anyways, uh... Yeah, I just I just wanted to enlighten you guys on these things because these are meant for eyebrows and there's another one. This one can be used. It's by e.l.f. Yeah, it's an eyebrow contouring eyebrow pencil. It's a little softer, but it's definitely an eyebrow pencil, an eyebrow because of the way it's shaped. Um, and again, these sh these ones are not eyebrow pencils. Or not eyebrow. They're eyeshadow. They're meant for blending and mixing and, you know, brushing out that beautiful thing. And this one right here... He is a, like, this is by being Blink Beauty also. Um, I had one more brush, but it broke, so I'm going to be getting more from, like, Sigma or Mo Morphe. Um, this guy right here I use for the corners of my eyes, but the tear ducts and or the edges to add a little bit of highlight on the contour on the brows and the eyelid. This guy right here is not an eyeshadow brush. I mean, it's, I mean, it is. It's not an eyebrow brush. Sorry about that. Um, the reason I'm saying this again, like I stated before, is that, I just really think that people need to educate themselves before they make videos based on um, just because they picked it up and they think it looks good. Because in all honesty, if you're going to be making educational videos, you should be knowing what you're talking about. So yeah, I just wanted to kind of hit on that, kind of give you guys just a quick, you know, something to listen to um, before I make a new video this week. I know I'm still new to the beauty community myself, but just a little bit of education never hurt anybody. So thank you for taking the three, four minutes this video is going to be to watch and listen to me kind of ramble and educate some people and just what I don't like. Um, I know my makeup area is dirty. I, I just made a mess this week <laughs> anyways if you like my videos go ahead and hit the red button down below and subscribe and or watch them um just because you like them you can follow me on instagram you can follow me on twitter you can also follow me on facebook i'll link all that stuff in the description down below thank you guys for watching and understanding how i'm feeling about this and i will see you guys next time